Hello everybody, welcome back to the farm. Now a new year, January. I'm gonna start off by taking this lettuce and honey to sell. Hopefully I can make it to the store. Truck is squatting pretty bad. Hey, I guess we're in North Carolina. Isn't that where all the squatted trucks are popular at? <laughs> yeah. Taste the is today best must for lettuce? I don't know. I'm selling, no it's not. I'm selling the lettuce and the honey early. The lettuce I'm selling early by one month. I think the honey I'm selling early by two months. However, with the lettuce, I am making, oh, the lettuce I'm making like a hundred or more bucks than I would sell it during the best price, the estimated best, best price at least. Okay, I'll go ahead and sell that. And I'm taking the honey too because I'm not making it as much as the best price. It's only paying like I think 700 or 800 bucks less than what I would be making. And each one, the best price is at the restaurant, so I can kind of you know do it all in one trip. So yeah, today today is going to be a money making. Today's video will be a money making video. Cause I got this stuff to sell, and then I'll go ahead and sleep. I believe it's if it's not next month, it's, if it's not February, it's March. That the sunflowers will be the best price. So I'll then I'll sleep until that day, and then sell the sunflowers. Where is my marker? There it is. I'm pretty sure it's going to the restaurant. I'm pretty sure I know where the restaurant is. I figured I'd mark it just to be safe. Wow, the truck is really struggling to haul this, but hey, that's a good problem to have. So I should be making some pretty good money off of here. Let's see, where's that turn off at? I think it's right here. Oh, I think he's turning. Yep. That guy showed me where it's at. Oh yeah, I think it's the... That's the same place I took the corn? I don't know. Yeah, I think it might be. Oh yeah, I'm excited to see how much money we'll get off of this stuff. Oh, I should have my 40 flashers on maybe. And hey, let's turn the light bar on as well. Oh, I might need to back up. I don't think I can stop. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> I'm holding down the brake. Back up. A lot of weight behind there. There you go. Alright. Slowly inch forward to get this stuff sold first. Okay, made that much off of those. Let's take all this. Holy cow. But that's not even all the way up. Nice. $37,430. Very good. Yeah, it's good I made that much money because I'm going to need it to pay a loan. <laughs> I'm thinking, actually I'm not thinking, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy the uh, big self-propelled John Deere sprayer. Uh, it's going to be a lot of money. But I think it'll be worth it because not only will I get my field sprayed pretty quick, but then I can use it to do contract jobs spraying other people's fields, which will make me more money. So yeah, I think it'll be worth it. Um, that and pretty sure, depending what kind of crop gets planted in that big field next to my farm, 
I might buy it this year. <laughs> Rather than waiting a while to buy it, I might buy it. I'll wait to see what gets planted in it. If it's something I can harvest without buying specialized equipment, then I will buy it this year, probably. And we'll have another feel for the farm, but a big loan. So yeah, I'm going to need all the money I can get. But I do think it'll be worth it, because yeah, if I get that self-propelled sprayer, then yeah, it makes life working along the farm easier, because I can get all my spraying done pretty quick. And I can do contract jobs, making extra money. And then with that bigger field too, yeah, I'd have a big old loan payment, but the amount of money I would get off of that field would make it so worth it. And I had, I had the idea, what I could do is, all the crops I get off of these fields around the farm that I made, I can keep those for myself to, like, to sell for profit. I'll keep that money pocket and go to the farm. Whereas all the money I would get off of the crops I sold out of that big field, I would just use all that money to go like straight into paying that loan. Just to get it down so the monthly payments aren't so high. But that's what my plan is for this year. But of course, yeah, like I said though, I know for a fact I'm going to get the sprayer, but the uh, field depends on what crop gets planted. If a crop I can harvest without specialized equipment gets planted in it, then I will buy it. But, yeah, yeah, if it's something that you need specialized equipment for, then I'll wait to buy it. <laughs> and, um, what else? Oh, yeah. I would like to get, at some point, horses. Because, first off, the chickens are not producing eggs. I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know if I need new chickens or new chicken house I don't know because I got a mix of chickens some of them are not old enough to make eggs but some of them are old enough to produce eggs I don't know why they're not doing that you ladies need to work harder <laughs> but uh, concerning that big field too if I buy it fly up in the sky and show you if I end up buying this what I think I might like to do is separate the field so that way I got, you know, two fields instead of just one field. Oh, maybe I just keep it as one. I don't know. I do know in another part of it, like up there in that corner, I would maybe like to put barns. This Now, this obviously, the barns and stuff like that wouldn't be for a while still because I'd be spending a lot of money on that loan. But at some point, I'd like to put barns in a big grain setup right there. Move all my arable equipment over there. And then for down here at the main farm... I would get like animals. I could keep the equipment for them here. But yeah, that will be a while down the road because I'll have a big loan to pay from that sprayer and from buying that field if I buy the field this year. So yeah, that, that stuff will, other stuff will be a while <laughs> down the road. <laughs> yeah, I'll go ahead and fast forward and sell some sunflowers. All right, guys, it's now February. Eh. Uh, best time to sell the sunflowers isn't until next month but just like the lettuce the best prices I can get is right now but it is going down so I know for a fact if I wait till next month to sell them it'll be even lower because they're going down right now so I need to get my truck out load it up start taking that to sell I think it said I should be looking to get around 18,000 total off of it I believe so hopefully that's right, because I need the money. <laughs> also, when I get that bigger field too, I'll probably want to buy a semi-truck and a hopper trailer. Instead of just using this one. This is nice, but yeah, if I get a big massive field like that, I don't think this will cut it. <laughs> Let's hold all okay, we'll hold all the sunflowers. Nope. I don't want to do that. I accidentally had to unload some. I got back up. I didn't. I couldn't remember if I had enough. Okay, it didn't dump it out. Okay, good. Oh, depending on how well this, depending on how well this load yields, I might have to start planting some sunflower, more sunflowers than just one field. Yeah, I'll 
I'm excited to see how well this pays me. See if it pays me what it says I'm supposed to get off of it. All right, guys, pulling in here. Yeah, let's get this stuff sold. See how much we make. Oh my stars. Oh my stars. 21,397. That's more than what it said it was going to give me. It said on the, when I checked it, it said I should make around 18,000 off of that. I won't complain about that though. Holy cow. Um, might have to switch up some crops I'm planting, guys. Hey, it'll give us a little different flavor anyway. A break from the cost of corn and soybeans. Maybe what I'll do... I might switch up completely from just corn and soybeans. I'm considering doing... Replacing the corn with sunflowers. And then replacing the beans with canola. I think canola pays better than soybeans, I believe. I could be wrong about that. I might need to check it. I feel like I, for some reason, I feel like I remember soybeans paying more than, or uh, canola paying more than soybeans. I don't know. I don't know. I might, for this year at least, switch out the corn, replace it with sunflowers. All right, guys, just got back here to the farm. Uh, I was wrong. Uh, soybeans. Do pay better than uh, canola, so I won't swap out the soybeans for canola. Though, even if canola did pay better than soybeans, I probably wouldn't do that because I was checking my planter and it can't plant canola, and I don't want to have to lease a cedar for that. <laughs> See, so yeah, I think, at least for this year, I think I will completely replace the corn with sunflowers. So yeah, I think. I think most fields will be that then. I think. Let's see. Actually, no. So, this field. This field right there. And. Yeah, those two fields will be soybeans. And so, uh, so that one. That one will be soybeans too. And this field. This little field. In this little field will be sunflowers okay got the planting pattern figured out now I just need to wait for the weather to warm up so I can plant so yeah that'll be it for today guys made a lot of money <laughs> very happy about that uh, thank you very much for watching and I can't wait to see you all again very soon bye